What's up everybody? Welcome back to the Crystal Palace. Today we are going to be talking about something that I personally love about Universal Orlando and that is annual pass holder perks for Halloween Horror Nights. So if you are a Universal Orlando annual pass holder, just know that if you're visiting Halloween Horror Nights or even just visiting during the HHN season and not even attending the event, there will be perks for you to enjoy. And in this video, we are going to break it all down. So let's get into it. Since we're right in front of it, let's start off with the first perk, and that is early access to the Tribute Store. So if you don't know, Halloween Horror Nights and all the Universal Orlando events have these really cool Tribute Stores in the park. They're open all day, not just during the event. And Universal Orlando annual pass holders get to experience the Tribute Store one full day before everybody else. This, of course, means lower crowds and just a fun little sneak peek into the amazing tribute store and don't forget with your annual pass you do get discounts on merchandise that you can of course use in the tribute store as well during halloween horror nights you can also find exclusive annual pass holder merchandise this year they have the mel's die-in merch which is a huge hit everyone is buying it and for good reason because it is so cute a good thing to know is that you don't have to be an annual pass holder in order to buy these like they won't check your pass to buy them but they do say uoap on it so if you're not one you might not want it but if you do you don't have to be a pass holder they won't check when you're purchasing but you can use your uoap discount so i recommend bringing that pass to show it to get the discount beginning october 1st pass holders can pick up a free pass holder exclusive magnet you can pick it up at the five and dime in universal studios florida or the universal pass holder lounge in toon lagoon in islands of adventure get it from october 1st to november 3rd Another way pass holders save at Halloween Horror Nights is with free parking. Premier pass holders get free prime parking on event nights. Preferred pass holders get free regular parking on event nights. And power pass holders get 50% off regular parking on event nights. It's important to note that free self parking is available after 6 p.m. for all guests on non Halloween Horror Night event nights and free parking after midnight on Halloween Horror Nights event nights is for everyone as well. Another great benefit of being an annual pass holder during Halloween Horror Nights is that you do get your pass holder discount on the HHN food as well. So who doesn't like saving money? During Halloween Horror Nights, pass holders also get access to exclusive pass holder treats. Like here at Central Park Crepes, you can get a chocolate peanut butter crepe or at Confisco Grill, a black serpent pasta. Or at Starbucks, you can get Witch's Potion Tea. One of the biggest perks for annual pass holders during Halloween Horror Nights is that you can save on tickets. Annual pass holders can save on select single night tickets in August and September, August 30th to the 31st, September 1, 4 through 8, 11 through 15, 18 through 22, and 25 through 29. So if you go on the Universal Orlando site, you'll, there are bubbles um, coming from somewhere. If you go on the Universal Orlando site, you will put in your little pass holder code and they will come up with some discounted tickets. Hey, it might be a few bucks, but it can save you money. If you are a premier pass holder, guess what? You get one night free admission to Halloween Horror Nights. Only on select nights though. So this offer is valid on the following dates. September 4 through 8, September 11th, 12th, 15th, 18th, 19th, 25th, 26th, 29th, October 2, 3, 9, 10, 30, November 1 through 3. So you just pick one of those dates and you can go for free. So tonight is actually team member preview night of Halloween Horror Nights. When you're going to be watching this video, Halloween Horror Nights will have officially begun. But that is why I'm kind of hanging out and I'm going to watch the opening ceremonies tonight because I never really get to see the opening ceremonies because I always get to do stay and scream. So I'll get to show you them and talk a little bit about if it's worth it or not to see them. With a Universal Annual Pass, not only will you save money at HHN, but you will also save time because with the Annual Pass, you can participate in Stay and Scream. This is a way to get into Halloween Horror Nights 
early, get in line early, and even do houses early. If you want to know more about that, check out my complete guide to Halloween Horror Nights. But just a quick little overview for this video. You won't have to purchase the Scream Early ticket, which will save you $55. You can go into the park whenever you want before five o'clock, get in line for one of the select houses that will open early, start your Halloween Horror Nights night, earlier than everyone else who will be waiting outside of the park gates. If you're an annual pass holder, you can actually book an exclusive pass holder hotel and event ticket package. It'll include a commemorative pass holder Halloween Horror Nights pin. So if you want to stay on property and go to Halloween Horror Nights, call up Universal and you can learn more about this really cool package offer. Universal Annual Pass Holders will be happy to know that they can save money on an RIP tour. Premier and Preferred Pass Holders get 10% off, while Power Pass Holders get 5% off. So if you want to experience HHN like a VIP or an RIP, you can get the RIP tour for a discounted price. Be sure to check out my opening night of HHN video as we did an RIP tour. So if you want to look into getting one for yourself, check out that video and I show you exactly what it's like. Pass Holders this year were also able to save on premium Scream Night. They saved $20. $25, so instead of $350, annual pass holders got to pay $325 plus tax for the premium scream night. You know, that was only one night only event. Check out my video on that too. But maybe next year, if they do have the event again, you'll be able to save. Okay, I got myself a mango pop from Freeze Ray Pops while I wait. Look at that. Oh, nice and cold. I haven't tried the mango yet. It's really hot out. All right, we're making our way out of the park now. Opening ceremonies are gonna start hopefully in about 30 minutes. There are so many people here for a team member night. This is so crazy, but I'm so glad they do have this team member preview night because that's super cool, so much fun. The team members get to, you know, do a little preview of it. This I'm like, I'm so excited for them. I'm like, I'm not even going, but I'm just like, oh my gosh. Like, have the best time, you guys. Like, look at all of them. Literally live it up, live it up. So this is where I'm gonna be, to the side of the gate, and I'm gonna watch the opening ceremonies from here. ceremonies are awesome. I love the lore of this year with Sinister and Surreal and their respective scare zones, Torture Fair and Demon Queens. However, I do think for any year that it is worth it to do Stay and Scream. This allows you just to, like I said before, to get in early, do houses early, especially since you have that annual pass. It's worth it. Get in the park before 5 p.m. And you just saw the opening ceremony, so there you go. You don't need to wait outside of the gates. <laughs> Purchasing a Universal Annual Pass is one of the best purchases that I've made. And when it comes to Halloween Horror Night season, the perks continue. During the year, you can enjoy discounts throughout the year, special events, the Annual Pass Holder Lounge. But specifically for Halloween Horror Nights, there are ways for pass holders to save time and money, and Universal knows how to treat their pass holders right. Are you an annual pass holder? Are you thinking about getting an annual pass? Let me know in the comments and leave any questions you have.
Thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned some tips about how awesome it is to be a pass holder during Halloween Horror Nights. Be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the Crystal Palace right down below. I will see you in the next one. Peace. Peace? Peace.